Are you an angry mama? Because I'm an angry mama. And you know what? So is she. And together, we're gonna clean out this microwave because it's gross. Hello, Katie here with Older and Wiser, and welcome to the channel. If you're new here, we put out videos about our travelings, and when we're not traveling, we have some tips and tricks and some product reviews and kind of a little bit of everything. So if that sounds interesting to you, you should hit the subscribe button and the little bell icon there. Well, that'll tell you when we upload new videos. Okay, so today we are reviewing a product. Now, I have seen this pop up as seen on TV. It's also been in my Facebook feed and I've always thought total scam. However, I'm to the point of desperation because I am the only one that cleans out the microwave and I've been on strike. So now it's gotten pretty bad and I don't like the idea of wedging myself in there to try to scrub it out. Now, a couple of my friends just recently got these and said that they work. So I wanted to try it, see if it's worth the 10 bucks. Quite honestly, um, she's angry and she's got my favorite colors, so I think it was worth it even if she doesn't clean the microwave. I mean, what's one more creature that doesn't clean the microwave around here? <laughs> Am I right? So let's put her to the test and see if she works. Okay, I can't believe I'm even gonna show you this, but this is what I'm dealing with, people. We have splatters all over the door. I have this in here so that people can cover their dishes, but it never gets used. And instead, I've got splatters everywhere. So this has got to end because it makes me crazy and I don't even use the microwave. Meet Susan. She's a mama, she's angry, and she's supposed to do the heavy lifting for me. Her hair comes off. Mmm, it's a little tough. There we go. Her head comes off. And on the back, you've got fill lines right here. So the cleaning solution that you use is just distilled white vinegar, water, and you can use a couple drops of lemon oil or some kind of essential oil or even lemon juice. Uh, just to kind of cover up the, the smell of that vinegar. Now, the box does say, warning, do not overfill. Boiling over might occur, which is funny because I'm boiling over about the state of the microwave because it's boiled over and it's disgusting. So, I'm gonna go ahead and fill this. You fill it up, follow the directions, you put it in the microwave on high for seven minutes, and then you let it sit there for two minutes. You remove her from her arms because they're supposed to be cool and then you use the leftover solution on a sponge to scrub away anything that didn't come off. So let's try this and cross your fingers because I am at my wit's end here. Okay, so we're gonna start with the vinegar and there's these fill lines on the back. Let's see, it's kind of hard to see. Oh, I think I overfilled her. Nope, pretty much spot on there. And then fill with water. Do not overfill. Nope, a little bit more. There we go. I think I overfilled a little, but that's okay. Like I said, so many things have boiled over. Then I'm going to add just a drop or two of my lemon essential oil, which I'm starting to run out of. Mental note, get some more because it's my favorite. And then you put her head back on. And there's these little grooves here and here and you line those up and she just goes right on like that and then you put the put her hair back on and kind of push it down there and then into the microwave she goes and oh Susan do your good do your good work here seven minutes we'll let it go and we'll check back in Nine minutes, I can do math. Nine minutes, we'll check back and see if she did what she is supposed to do. Hey Google, stop the timer. Okay, so the microwave stopped, I set a two minute timer, and here we are. 
And I can smell the vinegar, so. Okay, I see gunk everywhere. You're supposed to take out Angry Mama. Looks like she, she uh, didn't boil over, but and I think this is supposed to be a damp sponge. Oops, let me, let me just fix that. All right, okay, here we go. Got my step stool and, oh, oh my, that is coming off of there. Okay. Oh, yes. Oh, that is so gross. But guess what, guys? This is wiping off. I mean, this is coming off. And I'm not even really wiping. So impressed. Uh, um, wow. Just wow. So they said you could use some of the leftover solution. And there is a little bit in there. So I'm just going to, you know what, let me. Let me just take her head off real fast. That sounds weird. Pour this on here. How this does. Oh, it like wipes right off. There is a bunch of stuff crusted on here and it's just coming right off. Oh, wow. Again, I'm not, I'm not putting any elbow grease into this. I'm just, I'm just wiping it down and it's coming off. And I am so happy. Okay, so you guys, I am gonna call this a win. The microwave is clean. A job that would normally take me an hour took me about 15 minutes. There were still a few spots that I had to scrub, but it was way easier than usual. So now I am not an angry mama, I'm a happy mama. And if the kids mess this microwave up again, they're gonna to clean it themselves. Got it? Great. I would love to know if you end up trying this. We'll put a link below. We got it on Amazon. Super fun. Um, if you try it, let me know if it works for you. If you already have one and you love it, I want to hear about it. So anyways, thank you so, so much for watching our video. Uh, if you haven't already, hit the little subscribe button and uh, we'll see you next time.